Winters and support, uh, Representative Winters is support in support. Um, Chief? Great, is it Craig? Craig. Craig. Good afternoon. My name is Richard Craig Jr. and I'm the police chief in the town of Enfield. I've been a law enforcement officer for 25 years and I'm here speaking today on behalf of the Inter Association of Chiefs of Police. We are opposed to House Bill 492 as well as the two other bills to be heard later. Today. This, I believe, is my eighth year testifying before this body in opposition to the legalization or decriminalization of marijuana. Does anyone think that marijuana is good for you? That it's like eating your vegetables or drinking milk? Does anyone believe it will make our communities a better place? Of course not. Everybody knows the harmful effects of smoking marijuana. House Bill 492 takes the approach of taxing marijuana, which will raise much needed revenue for our state and allow law enforcement to focus on the big issues. Folks, let me tell you something. The majority of the big issues can be traced back to marijuana. Marijuana is the gateway drug. That's where it all starts. Ask anyone in our schools, like you just heard, kids are using drugs, it will say pot. <clears throat> our alcohol and drug counselors will say marijuana. And our mental health counselors and doctors We'll say the same thing. <coughs> the cost of our law enforcement and justice system is minimal compared to the cost on society. The lost revenue in our business community, the medical cost associated with marijuana use, and the greatest cost is the destruction of our children's futures. I often hear the comparison of alcohol. We all know the costs associated with alcohol and the addiction, the loss of families to me. The lives lost and the families destroyed. Legalizing marijuana or decriminalizing marijuana will only add to this. So please look closely at the consequences this legislation will have on our children. Let's focus on helping them, not harming them. Thank you. Any questions? Representative Robinson. So you would suggest seeing marijuana is illegal and it's working with Mike? Outlaw alcohol, which certainly is a much bigger uh, cause of physical violence and that kind of crime. Uh, Representative your response you can't ask. But he's it. testifying on all three bills, and I'm only a sponsor of one. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> well, <laughs> the, there's a comparison of alcohol and the comparison of marijuana, and we're saying, well, one's worse than the other. I think they're both, you know, bad. You know, they both have harmful effects. I've seen both of the consequences of marijuana and alcohol. Okay, a follow-up? Oh, yeah. You realize that the use of alcohol went up during Prohibition? <laughs> I wasn't. <laughs> I was clear in the room if there's any more of that. Okay. No. The, the, could I explain? The problem is criminals sell illegal substances. Licensed dealers. My brother runs small stores. They sell cigarettes. They don't sell to underage because they could ruin, lose their business. And when they would lose their tobacco business, the gas business, the beer business, everybody else would go with it. So they are much more act to not sell to under age <coughs> and, and wouldn't it make more sense to regulate this than put it in the hands of the underworld? I was at a conference uh, two years ago out in Chicago and a police officer from Amsterdam came and spoke. Their experiment with uh, decriminalizing marijuana, because it would be legal in Amsterdam, 
They have an increase in fires because of the uh, illegal cultivation of marijuana, the indoor grows. The criminal enterprise there, organized crime, has taken over the marijuana industry. The diversion of electricity to, you know, growing the marijuana is problematic over there. So whether you're you're talking about you know a parent or a child, the harmful effects are still the same. Oh, no, it's illegal. that's it. No. Dip, Tim, we're on 492. You step. But he's not going to testify in the others because this is his testimony of the other. But that doesn't yeah. come up on the other yeah. one either. Chief, are you testifying simply on 492 right now? As you said before then. It's a hearing on 492. Well, that's three. all he can testify. I'm just no. So, so are you going to come back on the other bills? I can't. Uh, you get plenty. So I can ask him a question. Oh, I don't mind. <laughs> Is there anyone else who would like to ask questions? Seeing none, thank you, Chief. I just would like to express to everybody here, we should not have clapping and leading people on and praising them. We're either for or against this. We're all here. We should respect whoever is testifying, whether they're for it or against it. And I'll ask you to refrain from Hopping or anything else in the future. Thank you. Yes. Yeah.